Cletus, Cletus, where are you at, boy? I'm over here, boss, slapping the pigs like you told me to. Forget that, we got pumpkins to tend too. All right, boss. Stop your whining, Johnny. You're being a little bit ridiculous with what you want, though. It's got to be big. It's got to be grand. It's got to be something. I don't know, something. It's got to pop. Yeah, it's going to pop my spine out of place if I lug one of these giant rocks of a pumpkin that you want. Oh, don't be a drama queen. Everybody must suffer for their art. That's yeah, but I always have to wind up suffering for your art. How fair is that? Look. Everybody's expecting something great for the Halloween episode of our show. We can't, we can't just show up with an eeny weeny teeny weeny little pumpkin, can well, we? Can't we just pull some like TV movie magic and just throw a magnifying glass on front of the camera and make it look big? This isn't one of your dates, Johnny. Hey, it was in January and she wanted to go skippy dipping. Skinny dipping. Skippy dipping? Whatever. It's peanut butter. Who's skippy? Wow, wow. There's no way I was gonna pick that thing up and strap it to my back. It was the size of a Buick, man. <gasps> mm -mm -mm. Keep still, my southern heart. Maybe if you would have brought the little red wagon with you, we would have had no problem with this. But these things I'm are I'm sorry you didn't bring your little red retarded wagon. You want a pumpkin on voids, man. Hello. Can I help you two find a pumpkin, young lady? Oh, yes, absolutely. I was telling my co-host over here, Mr. Johnny 13, that we need to have something big, something spectacular. We need a pumpkin that's something. That's not going to cost an arm and a leg, hopefully. Depends on whose arm and leg. Huh? I have to agree with the young lady when it comes to pumpkins. Bigger is better. See, Johnny, I told you so. The only reason why he's agreeing with you is because the bigger the pumpkin you get, the more money he gets to stuff into his overalls. Johnny, don't be rude. I'm sure he's just trying to help us rude. find the perfect pumpkin for our show. Mm-hmm. 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 We're not getting anywhere here. Can we just go? All right, let's start on the other end of the patch. Maybe we'll find something there. Mm, Thank you, farmer. You're welcome. Bye-bye. Anytime, pretty lady, just make sure you pick your pumpkin before sundown. Why, is that when the farm closes? Oh no, that's when Pumpkin Ed comes around looking for his next victim. Did you just say Pumpkin Head? Like, in the movie? Not Pumpkin Head, man. Pumpkin Egg. Who's Pumpkin Ed? He's the spirit of Halloween. What makes him so scary? Anyone caught out on the pumpkin patch near sundown becomes his next victim. What do you mean, victim? <laughs> he turns you into a pumpkin. Oh, okay, Charlie Brown. Well, we're gonna go find ourselves a pumpkin, and we'll be sure to keep our eyes built for Pumpkin Ed. Let's just get out of here. What a whack job. We gotta start coming up here. Don't be a fool, boy. Never underestimate the power of the great pumpkin head. You, you all come back now, you hear? Bye-bye. You'll be sorry, pumpkin head's gonna get you. It's not like huge. Um, just grab one and let's go. Why are you acting so scared anyway? You heard what the farmer said. What, that backwoods garble about a pumpkin egg coming out to make turn you into a pumpkin? I don't want to get turned into a pumpkin. That's you what can't I'm saying. Be pick a pumpkin and get out of here. You're not going to get turned into a pumpkin, although I really hope that could happen. And just, look, just grab a pumpkin and we'll go. Okay, how about that one? All right, fine. You grab the pumpkin, I'll go pay for it, and I'll meet you out front. I said in the flesh. Oh. 
Are you gonna turn me into a pumpkin? No, it's too early. What was that? I said it's too early. Oh. Well, what are you doing here then? Uh, I'm just hanging out a little bit. I like to be punctual, you know? If I show up late, Farmer gets mad at me. Cletus, is that you? Yeah, it's me. The farmer pays me to wear this thing and try and scare people. He thinks this pumpkin ed legend is going to drum up more business. Don't say nothing, all right? Your secret safe with me. Well, I think I better go start scaring some people. Bye. Happy haunting, freak. Roxy! Roxy! Where did you go? Yeah, we're good. Are you weird? No. Yeah. What? 